Welcome back everybody, I'm Jade Monkey. we're back here in Rust, talking about that Rust console edition for the PlayStation 4, the Xbox One, Next Generations, and everything in between. And yes, today we're like, hey, when's that new content coming in for Rust console edition? I know we've been over this before, but I know since we're all anxiously awaiting, it's like TikTok, what's going on? When is this update? Um, the real news is, uh, we have no idea other than March, and we literally only have about two weeks left. Now, this is how this is going to work. Now, uh, what do we mean by new content? Well, we don't even know what the content's going to be yet. We'll go over that here in a second. We have a pretty good idea of maybe what it could be narrowed down to be, uh, but this is mostly specifically focused on the update and when. So we're looking at um, usually Thursdays. Uh, so we only have March 24th, 2022 and March 31st, 2022 that are left. Now, um, that's not to say that these the PTB update couldn't happen at any time. It's just these are the major milestones. Typically that happens. I think we're still kind of in that 24th range or even a little bit before, if that makes sense. That's my guess. I would say something's up if it's the 31st is, is my guess also. Um, so expect something this coming week. Um, yeah, and uh, possibly on like a Tuesday. Typically, we don't see these things on a Friday, but these aren't major releases. And speaking of releases in different types, PTV stands for Public Testing Branch. Why does that matter for the normal Rust? Well, things come into PTB first. Uh, they get tested there. We actually get to play them. If you have Deluxe or Ultimate, if you're wondering how to get it, it is a separate download. Um, so go ahead and look for Public Testing Branch or Rust Console Edition Public Testing Branch if you bought those, um, as it is a completely separate download. And um, yeah, so uh, like going over to the content side of it, well, what, it, what it's not for sure is not electricity. They have confirmed that. So it looks like turret spam will continue uh, yet again. But uh, they are still percolating that. They are still brewing it, which is really, really nice. Um, there's two other, well, I guess three likely scenarios here. There could be a hot air balloon, which is, uh, I would say, maybe less likely, but it is a possibility, a form of transportation. But I think the other more likely mode of transportation, if that is indeed what we do get, is going to be horses. Look at this guy. Look at him go. Whoop. And I know we've been over this before, but the more I kind of looked at this uh, for horses, I was like, maybe ranches? Maybe Ram Ranch? Um, so, if you didn't know, and I know we've been over this before, but again, it's worth mentioning because we're, we're all very, very anxious for this. Um, ranches are a place where horses um, can be purchased. Uh, here's the scrap count here, and you purchase the saddle, then you, you grab the horse. I think it's more likely going to be, or, yeah, I'd say likely that these will spawn on the roads, and then you have to capture them, or just get on them and ride away with them. And the way to keep them in your base is you feed them through the troughs and stuff, and so on and so forth. Uh, it does have armor that comes with it. Again, that's if we do get the transportation. Oh, look at that balloon. Perfect timing. Although I'd say if things kind of go into the Straits of Dire, not Straits of Dire, but what's a better way to phrase it? If these things aren't ready, right? balloons, horses, whatever it is. I'm going to say we have a monument chance, possibly something like power, um, not power search, what is it? Power plant or even junkyard. Although, like I said before many times, I think there'll be some mutiny if it is just monuments, right? I think we need something a bit more substantial. Not to say that we don't want monuments. We definitely do. But I think for this update, since power surge isn't coming in, you know, transportation would be extremely nice. And we do have oil rig now, which is also good. Um, so yeah, that's what we have so far. I really think it's going to be sometime this coming week, possibly Tuesday, Wednesday. Um, if it starts to leak into the 31st week, you know, I, I just, I don't know what it's going to be then, to be honest. It, uh, most likely monuments would be my guess. Um, hard to say. And again, as soon as we get official word from everybody, which again, I'm assuming we'll either hear or see something this coming week, uh, the week of the 24th of March, we will certainly let everybody know. But we just want to give everybody an update because I know we've been brewing on this. You know, March is, is coming through and we're like, hey, what's up? We haven't heard any official word yet. Oh, yeah, by the way, um, there will be a skin store rotation on the 24th. Did that balloon just come down? So there is also another strong likelihood because there are updates that get pushed through. But again, this is for PTB, not main branch. Um, but we could also see some slight fixes that will be coming in from main branch as well. As you know, they've kind of cut them up in uh, previous patches and stuff, which seems to be working quite well. All right, so that's what we have so far. Sorry, it's not anything earth-shattering quite yet, uh, but hopefully we'll have that official news in a handful of days. I hope, I hope, I hope. So again, drop a like if you find it useful and helpful. And if you're into it, consider dropping that subscribe. Turn on those notification bells. 
Oh yeah, we're also doing a uh, Zerg event over on the console edition. Um, I will go ahead and link that video or live stream now in the upper right hand corner. Everything you need to do to find that activity. These aren't flying anymore? What's going on? Uh, so yeah, it's like a Zerg village that we're doing over on the console edition for PlayStation and Xbox, so stay tuned for that. Uh, it is actively going on even when we're not live streaming it, but we do also live stream it, so come on, come on by and say what's up. Alright, we'll see you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye!